Hey ladies, I wanted to come to you today and share with you a few projects that I have been working on this past week for a friend of mine who um, just recently got her first house. Um, she's a single girl, loves life. I had just wanted to share my creativity with her house. <laughs> so I pretty much just played with what I had and come up with a lot of pretty cool things actually. Um, she had a different color theme for each room and I pretty much just played with <clears throat> all the colors. Um, I'm going to start with her living room. Um, I thought it was pretty unique. Uh, it's pink and brown, or pink and chocolate. Um, so I kind of, she wanted wall decor, so I was in, the, in that theme of making different wall decor stuff. I'm going to start with this. Um, it's like a, I just did the heavyweight cardstock. <clears throat> and made like a, a wall sign. She's very inspirational Christian. Um, she loves life so I pretty much just put this together. It's called the Worlds of Life and I had all these different stickers here that I thought um, represented her. So I pretty much just put it all together and I distressed the edges with brown and of course the background's pink. I don't know if you guys can see it. And then I had some iridescent pearls um, strand here so I just did that and tied some pink and brown ribbon on it. I love how it turned out. I I um, had a lot of fun making it. I had some bling and this is a uh, epoxy sticker. I love how the um, it's like a floral swirl. I love that. I, I just love how it turned out. Then I had made her a she is a um, she has an awesome voice. She sings at um, her church and some local gigs here and there. Um, so I had decided to make this plaque. It's, uh, this is just like a wood plaque. It had a, p a little picture on it or whatever. Um, I had added some music notes, scrap of paper on the back, distressed the edges. I had cut out the shoe, the lip print, and the dress form I had already had as a die cut. And I just added some bling to it. I love how it turned out. I distressed the um, the patterns too. I just absolutely love how those turn out. It is so cute and it perfect for her living room theme. I was just like, I, and I sent her a picture because I was so excited. She's like, oh my gosh, I love it. I'm really, I, 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 I'm very unique with my stuff and that's where I came up with my name. Um, so everything that I try to do and create, I try to make it my version style, whether it be something that I seen on YouTube, online, somewhere, whatever, I like to twist it around into my own theme, and that's pretty much where I came up with this. I've never seen anything like this before. I don't know if it's out there. If it is, okay, but I just wanted to make something fun for her. Then, um, let's see, I had some old, um... Um, wine glasses here that I have found <clears throat> and uh, she likes um, butterflies and, and anything to do blingy so I pretty much just put these together just for something fun um, added a little bit of embellishments and rhinestones on the bottom some ribbon and some bling up here. Um, she wanted something so she can put candles in, so I figured this would be good for tea light candles, whatever. It's just something fun. Nothing biggie, just something fun and girly like she is. Um, then I had some... I found these at a thrift store. They are um, wood... They're like wood flowers. And she wanted something like distressed and aged um, also for her wall. So what I had did was Mod Podge some um, scrap of paper on here and just tore, oh, I think, what did I do? Yeah, I just tore the edges around here and then distressed it after that. And then I put some glossy accent on. I don't know if you can see the glossiness. But yeah, I did it with everyone. They're all, they're different sizes. They go in a set of three. I just had fun. Uh, she was just looking for something fun um, and distressed. So that's that. <laughs> uh, I had fun making it, though. I can tell you that. And here's another plaque that I made. She likes butterflies. It's a um, pink and brown. The letters are silver, metallic, and then I just added some bling to it, bling to the, to the corner. <clears throat> and then one of those from Elsmerella from the butterfly selection um, then just added some ribbon I love it uh, I'm gonna I think I'm gonna make one for my own but in my colors my colors are brown and gold and black um, but yeah that's it's fun 
I was going for fun, and that's what I did because that's what kind of person she is. Okay, now for her uh, kitchen. Her kitchen is a uh, black and white theme, but it's kind of the cafe style. Now, I don't have anything cafe, so I kind of just played with what I had and made her one of my famous uh, clipboards that I make here. So, um, this is this is probably not going to work out for me the way I want it to, but <clears throat> what I had did was just covered it with scrap of paper like I do, and then here I had a template for a teacup. <clears throat> now, I mean a teapot. I know it's cafe style, but she said teapots are fine because she has some teapots that she's going to hang up. And then I had to put the stickers on it to spell out notes, and then took my um, glossy accent and went over it to make it look like the puffy epoxy letters. I love how it turned out. And then up here, I just did the charms and the ribbon and flowers. And she's a big Christian, like I said. So I did the, um, I don't know if you can see it here. I did the, the cross charm I put up there with the flower. It's just something fun. Um, she's very unique, just like myself. So I figured, hey, why not? <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and make something that I know she'll like and of course I sent her pictures of everything for her approval and of course I get Amber oh my gosh so then I made a little and I really didn't have to do much to this it's a butterfly frame magnet for um, her refrigerator and it's got two picture holes in it and then I just painted it black and added some brown bling and some silver bling in the middle it's very simple nothing biggie but I figured I'd give her something for her fridge. <laughs> um, then, let's see what else did I make here. Did the, the coasters, covered the coasters just for her bedroom. Her bedroom is purple and green, but she said she likes zebra print, so I figured I'd make her some of these. Then, this is another heavyweight cardstock um, plaque I made for her room. She's uh, very big into live life, love, dream. So I just made one that has all different words about dream, dream big, um, butterflies, just something fun. She needed something for her room. She didn't have anything for her room to hang up. So I was like, hey, let me go ahead and make that. Um, then I made her some just random bookmarks. She loves to read, so I figured I'd make her some. And I made her some tags, To Then I made her a... Um, this is another, this is those um, four by six picture frames that you can buy for the refrigerator. I just altered it up a little bit and put Eat, Love, Pray on there with some ribbon and bling for her kitchen refrigerator. Then this little guy here, oh, this thing don't fall down. I found this, uh, this was in a uh, bag of wood products I had got from the thrift store. Um, I seen this, I was like, you know what, I'm not going to use this for cooking. I'm going to like alter it up and decorate it for something. I didn't know what though. But as soon as she told me that she was doing the cafe theme and it was brown, white, and black, I just figured this would go good. So what I had did was just add some ribbon and bling and I glued these little um, buttons on and then added a screw, to, added a deal to the back to hang up on the wall. And I love how it turned out. It goes with her theme and works for me and her. So. It's all good. All right, ladies, um, that is it for now. I have a lot more going on. Um, I will be catching up with some more videos here in the next couple days to see what I can come up with. I'm also going to start um, doing a, a drawing because I now have sources to get a hold of a whole bunch of stuff that I can um, give out. So I'm going to start a drawing and it's for all my subscribers um, they will be entered into a drawing and I'll make each thing a theme like I will send you out a theme of stuff as soon as I can get everything together or whatnot and we will go from there alright ladies you guys have a wonderful weekend and I will talk to you next time bye bye